This is my mama's makeup and crochet channel. Hello, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, welcome. This video is a part of my gradient yarn inspired eye makeup series. Today's inspiration is this blue granite yarn from Crochet by Caris. There. So I tried to replicate the colors of this yarn on my eyes. There they are. This is one of my favorite yarns. I actually listed my top 20 plus favorite yarns from Crochet by Caris, and this one is included there. If you want to check it out, I will put the link down below. This actually also reminds me of Ravenclaw colors, you know, from Harry Potter. I mean, the Ravenclaw colors from Harry Potter movies. The Ravenclaw colors in the books are bronze and blue, Gryffindor, gold and scarlet, Hufflepuff, black and yellow, and Slytherin silver and green. So I don't know why they changed the Ravenclaw colors in the movies, but it's okay. I like this uh, colorway. I like my eye makeup right now. Obviously, I'm a Potterhead, so hello to all the Potterheads out there. And on the Pottermore website, I was sorted into Gryffindor, so hello fellow Gryffindors. Anyway, let's move on. Okay, to achieve this eye makeup, I used two palettes from Jeffree Star Cosmetics. Cremated and Blue Blood. Okay, so there you go. Well, I think that's it. And please keep on watching. We are going to start our makeup tutorial. Okay, let's go straight to primer because my face is already moisturized. I'm using Photo Focus face primer Dewy Luminox from Wet n Wild. Okay, so just dot 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 all over my face. So I think the finish is really supposed to be like this because it says Dewy Luminox so it's a luminous finish. And for my foundation, I'm using Maybelline Superstay 24 Hour Full Coverage Foundation. This is in Natural Ivory. I know it looks super light right now. I look like a ghost, but don't worry, it will warm up after a few minutes. Yeah, it's always like that with me. And for my concealer, I'm using L'Oreal Infallible Full Wear Concealer in Natural Rose. Under my eyes, dots, dots, and on a few dark spots. Okay, so let's just blend it out with this uh, brush. Okay, I think I put too much, but let's make it work. And now I'm doing my eyebrows using this Maybelline Define and Blend Eyebrow Pencil in Natural Brown. Okay, so this is how I do my brows. First, I outline. Then I fill it in. And blend out using this pulley that comes with the pencil. And now we will move on to our eyes. Of course, we have to put our base first. This is Essence I Love Stage Eyeshadow Base. And for the eyeshadow, I will be using two palettes today, Blue Blood and Cremated from Jeffree Star Cosmetics. And let's start off with this uh, Life Insurance shade from the Cremated palette for our transition shade. Right above the crease but not reaching the brow bone. For our crease, I'm switching to the Blue Blood palette. This shade is also called Blue Blood. Blue. 
And for our outer corner, let's use Undertaker from Blue Blood. And let's pack this blue Monday shade on the center of the lid. And on the inner corner, I will use the shade Embalmed from the Cremated Palette. And this is actually just the base. I will top this with a shimmer shade. And for the shimmer shade, I will spray my brush first with this uh, Glow and Tone Makeup Setter from Fresh Skin Lab. Let's try Mortuary Beautician. Oh, I love this. Okay, let's add Blue Monday and blend it with the Mortuary Beautician shade. And I will go ahead and put eyeshadow on the bottom lash line. So, this is Undertaker. This is Blue Monday. And this is Goodbye. Okay. And let's include the tear ducts. I think I'm done with the eyeshadow. I will just clean up this area right here, put false eyelashes and eyeliner off camera, and I will be back. For my contour, this is Aura Contour from Vice Cosmetics. The shade is Confirm. Okay, this is a uh, Filipino makeup brand. On the jawline. And on the sides here, on the temple area, and on the forehead. For the blush, this is also from Vice Cosmetics. It's Aura Blush and the shade is Applauded. Also from Vice Cosmetics, this is Aura Glow. The shade is splendid for our highlighter. And let's highlight our brow bone as well using Splendid. And using Confirm, let's contour our nose. Let's highlight our nose using Splendid. Also our Cupid's bow. And I lined my lips using this uh, Flormar waterproof lip liner. The shade is number 202. For the lipstick, I'm using the shade Taupe from MAC Cosmetics. And let's add a little lip gloss. This is MAC Lip Glass. The shade is Oh Baby.
Okay, and I will just apply setting powder. This is L'Oreal Hydra Perfecte Perfecting Loose Powder. The shade is translucent. And for the final touch, this is Urban Decay All Nighter Makeup Setting Spray. And this is our final look. Once again, this eye makeup is inspired by this gradient yarn called Blue Granite. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope that you like this look as well. Please don't forget to give this video a huge thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already and also don't forget to click on that notification bell. Thank you so much for dropping by and see you soon. Bye! Like if you like this video. Subscribe if you love it. Share if you care. Thank you for watching. Bye!